Oh. You're twitching up a storm. I, you know, I really wish it would just, you know, work the first time rather than me restarting the game and everything else. I wonder what Sean will play after this. You know? All right. I know, right? And there's my notification letting me know that you're twitching away. Followed by flashes, blinding flashes, sounds of explosions. <laughs> Oh my god. Have, What's going on? Have coming in. Wait. That's um What did he just say? Confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear oh detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. Codsworth? Oh my god. Um this Oh my oh. god. We need to get to the vault. Now run to the vault! Of Sanctuary Hills. If you are registered. like the guy that's waiting to get in if you're in the program in the room. step forward otherwise I mean, return home it's classic there we, go. we need to get in we're on the list infant adult male adult female okay go ahead thank you good luck sir and god help us all You two, follow me! Come on! What's gonna happen to all those people outside We're the gate? We're doing everything we can! Now keep moving! Step on the platform! In the center! Almost there! Is Sean okay? He's fine. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Oh my god! Oh. oh no, the battery is low too. God! Hold on! This is what happens when you have kids. You have two controllers, and then one kid takes the controller off, then your wife takes another controller off, and then they're both not on the charger. <laughs> and then, you start playing games, you know, it's like, oh, I'm going to game for like two to three hours. I've been gaming for 30 minutes and my controller is almost dead. <laughs> Story of my effing life. Oh man. We're okay. Let me get my cell phone charger. Proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just Yes, up the stairs. I can't believe it. If we left them minute later oh. you're safe now everyone just head up these stairs and through the door there here's the ironic part i'm streaming while watching a stream of sniper elite while wishing to while talk, while listening to a guy talk about germans up the stairs and through the door all right and controller is charging. Thank goodness. Damn kids. Of course, you know, then you also end up watching My Little Pony for hours on end. Up the stairs, please. I know, right? Look, it's Deacon! No, I'm just kidding. Just step over to the table. Yeah, looks fine. One vault seat. 
I'll just head down the hall. Each of you take one of these. Your brand new bomb suits. It's down Thanks. the hallway right there. You, what now? You know, just you ever you know when you're playing the first part of the game, Crash, you ever feel oh that uh follow me. Vault Tech is uh, image selective. See? Cause you know, you got the two heavy set with people on the outside. Oh, you're gonna love it here. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that yeah. those aren't great, mind you. It's gone. Our home. Everything we had. I am. Father down in DC. How long do you think we'll be down here? Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we'll have to get through first. Dude, it sounds like you're getting attacked by a freaking super mutant. <laughs> Excuse me. Just step in here and put your vault here. Who is my little guy, huh? I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. There she is, see? All set. Step inside and put on your vault suit. All right. Now I get to go watch my husband get murdered. So how's work going? Good. That's good. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. I like wishing you could hear your game going off. It's funny. <laughs> Get your headset that pipes the sound through your headphone. Headphones. <laughs> no, it's because I have my volume up. Yeah. Uh, I could probably stop watching this stream. It's not like anybody's watching mine, but I can stop watching the one I'm watching. I go to my channel, make myself feel better. So I got my computer up, so I got chat and stuff up too. So if someone chats, I can actually see what they're saying. But no one's going to chat because it's just me watching my own stream. Who did this? Uh, it's okay. one night more down. I promise. Thanks to 
Yay! You know, I never noticed that. I think one of my mods updated. Yay, I found horse manure. Well, that's good, man. I mean, unless you're trying to get yourself out of a shitty situation there. Yeah, okay, there's one thing I wish we could do. And I think mod I think there are mods to do it. At least for Xbox, there might be. Giant roaches. Dual wielding weapons. What the hell? You know? Wouldn't, uh -huh. that, be wouldn't that be cool to do in Fallout? Dual wield pistols. Oh, speaking of which. Come on, I'll show you how it works. Why don't you hop on and give it a try? Monsters are crossing the bridge. Get in the lane and fire. Woohoo! More horse manure! I'm sorry, what was that, sir? I said, woohoo! More horse manure! Uh, okay, why are you gathering horse manure? Is it for your quest in Dragon Quest, or...? No, my quest in Dragon Quest is kill monsters and find out why all the monsters in this game went crazy. Okay. That's my main quest, is figure out why all the monsters went crazy and then put a stop to it. So... You think horse it's... manure is just an alchem is just an alchemical ingredient. Horse manure is not an alchemical ingredient. Okay. First of all, <laughs> first of all, horse manure is natural. All right. It comes out of a horse's butt. <laughs> I know. And alchemy uses natural materials and makes unnatural materials. Therefore. Anything that occurs in nature, or is man-made, is now chemical material in this Where game. Is Where is it? Just like kitty litter. Kitty litter is basically sand anyways. I know, right? <laughs> oh. Oh, that was your was that your game or was that your phone? Thank you so much. That was my game. <laughs> oh. There we go. 
All right. You know, I've been in this office a dozen times. Okay, so you know the overseer's office? Mm -hmm. In the vault. You know, I've been through it a dozen times. You know, and I've never thought of that. I just thought of this now, because the pistol's sitting on the desk. So you think the overseer shot himself in the head? Or do you think he just died from starvation? He probably was about to shoot himself in the head when somebody shot him in the head oh, for him. Left? No, see, I'm looking at the skeleton now. There's no bullet wounds. It's like he just died. Now, the skeleton's now moving because of the damn glitches, because, you know. Okay, that's creepy as heck! <laughs> that... <laughs> oh... oh, God. <laughs> Dude, no! Okay, are you watching my stream? No, I'm not. Oh, my God. So, I'm literally looking at the skeleton, and he just lifted his head and looked at me. Really? Really? Dude, that is creepy as shit. <laughs> ammo, get some ammo. Nice. Coming back later for you. Bobby pins. There are bobby pins right here somewhere. All right. Yeah, cigarettes. I could always use cigarettes. Too bad there's not a cigarette. Are you sure mod. about that? I, huh? I could use some. There's so um another YouTuber that I watch videos on. Which actually, I've missed the past couple of days. I need to get on there and watch them. Oxhorn. Mm -hmm. He's got a mod where his characters are actually like smoking like a pipe or a cigar or a cigarette, which is actually kind of cool. Yeah. Yeah, that does sound cool. No, you know, credit. It's not healthy for you one way or the other, but... You know, it is kind of cool. It's cool. Okay, are there any more stuff? Okay, there's no... Ooh, glasses. Glasses are good. Let's see. Glasses are always good. There we go, okay. Yeah, I can put the glasses on. I cannot put glasses on her yet. I don't have a bit boy. Do 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 do. All right, I think I got them all. Oh, no, I didn't. Yeah, so you want to know what it what its uh, description is? Is anyone alive? What? Did anyone get out? An equine ex extra that exudes a pungent perfume. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, are you serious? Yeah, that's what it's that's the description for horse manure. 
Wow. A peculiar powder that purring pets apparently prefer. What purring pets? Kitty litter. Am I the only ah. one left? <laughs> Freshly squeezed cow's milk straight from the udder. <clears throat> the light, lustrous wing of a fluttering thing. You know, I bought this stuff to put alcohol in it. You know, I am just drinking it. <laughs> and also spilling it all over myself. Fail. Durka 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 dur. Well, you know. I do what I can. Nah, oh, really? I'm about to head into monster-infested territory? I would've never thought that. Yeah. Alright, let's Good. get out of the vault. Ugh. Let's get out of the vault and watch things go boom. I think one of my mods, the one, whatever one I updated last, changed my lighting because uh, the lighting looks a lot brighter. Hey, I found a slime drop. Enjoy your return to the surface, and thank you for choosing <sighs> I 
device that can capture defeated monsters and bend them to our will. This is a discovery indeed. <laughs> I like it. Dude, sometimes your game just randomly, your speak mic will pick up the random most inner points of the game. You know? Codsworth, what happened to the world? The world, Mum? Well, besides our geranium still being the envy of Sanctuary Hills, I'm afraid things have been dreadfully dull around here. Things will be so much more exciting with you and Sir back. Where is your better heart? They... They killed him. Oh, Mum, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this, this dire mood. Strategy had a proper family act. Not always. Sometimes having... Having the strongest weapons and armor is the key to victory. Is the land... It I just like depends swords. on what. Sean's been kidnapped. <laughs> of course you do, fighter. Of course you do. Back. I like swords. I Welcome to Corneria. <laughs> no, no, that's not possible. Two-fisted monkey-style attack. Not two hundred years. A bit over two hundred. As fighters getting hurled towards a pack of monsters. Minor dings to the old chronometer. That means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack. You must be famished. Codsworth, you're acting. A little weird. What's wrong? I... I... <laughs> it's been just horrible. <sighs> with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets our nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> nothing! Don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. And the car, the car. 
Ui. Whoa, whoa. Focus, Codsworth. I'm afraid I don't know anything, Mum. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were, were dead. I, I did find this hollow tape. I believed so was going to present it to you as a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. Thank you, Codsworth. You're welcome. Now, enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? Sir and young Sean may turn up yet. All right. Lead the way. Proud to serve, Mama. <sighs> you know what time it is? Probably monk bunk ba ba Smoke sign? Huh? Smoke time? Si sí, senor. Bring me one. Out there, Codsworth. Oh. I need to find him. What about Concord, Mum? A few people there. And last I checked, they only pummeled me with sticks a few times before I had to run back home. Thanks for your help, Codsworth. Good luck, Mum. Oh. Stop doing that, that's contagious, you know that, right? What, yawning or coughing? Both. Well, my cough is because of smoke. It's because of smoking. Well, yeah, I know that. Which is surprising because I very rarely get sick now. Yeah. I almost never get sick. <laughs> yeah. Despite the fact that I'm a fat ass motherfucking idiot. <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> Wow, okay, wait, wait. You can say sometimes to at least one of those classifications. Yeah. Man, I still wish DC's was open. I know, right? You work tomorrow? Enter. The... No. No. No, I do not. Ah. So yeah, Randall's getting a uh, 
email from Dalton. Uh, who happens to be Ryan's boss. Oh, yeah? Yeah. So, needless to say, Chase no, wait, probably I'm... won't be around much longer. Okay, no, wait, I'm confused. Now, were these two, yes. aren't they, like, related by marriage or something like that? Uh, they will be. Okay. Once the way actually happens between his mom and the GM. Okay, and the big boss wanted to get rid of them, right? Yeah. The guy, the guy above the GM. Okay, and the guy wants to get rid of him because he can, or just because they're not performing, or... Uh, oh. The... Not performing to Papa standards. Okay, say that all again. Because you cut out. Because you're too far I... away from your PlayStation. Come back in. Ah. You started. No, I'm yawning. <laughs> God. I should go to bed soon. Mm. Why? You'll get plenty of sleep when you die, man. But sleep is for the weak. <laughs> Says someone who works in overnight job. All right. So Doc was one. Okay, so, as I was saying, the guy above the GM's boss wants to get rid of both the GM and the AGM, all because of one incident, one incident during a competition where we were trying to beat other stores in our area for CSC and out the door times. What's CSC mean? Uh, customer satisfaction count? You know, if I thought about that a little bit harder, I probably could have figured that out. <laughs> Sorry, I had to think about it for a second because I'm tired. <laughs> Telling you, man, sleep for a week. But yeah, the uh, AGM, though, he does not perform up to Papa standards. He pretty much half asses everything he does, as do most managers. Not Dalton. 
I said most. I didn't say all. Right, right, right. When it's just him and another driver, or him and one other person, and that other person happens to be a driver, he will go out after the driver has left the building on a delivery to have a cigarette. He'll leave mid-rush to go home. Chronic lateness never shows up when he is scheduled to be there at. Always shows up half an hour late. On top of that, he's a stoner. And do makes no effort to hide that fact. Oh, and not to mention, he's only 19 years old. Man, the guy's got a pretty stellar career going there. I know, right? In all honesty, he never should have been promoted to AGM. Yeah, well, you know, we've had worse managers. Yeah, yeah, we have. Sweet. Welcome to Let us pray. <sighs> All right. I have gained two levels since I lo since I started. That's nice. from my previous save file. Uh. Oh. Alrighty then. I'm gonna be level two and I haven't even left Sanctuary Hills yet. Dude, there's only 24 minutes on for the for Sword Art Online Rehollow Fragment to be finished. Yeah, I thought about redownloading that uh, Neverwinter again. I kind of miss playing it. I know, right? You know that game was fun. It wasn't that bad of a game. No, it wasn't. And it's free. until I jumped until I jumped way ahead of you. Yeah. You gotta love free games. I know. Free games are free games are usually the best games. However, some free games that you get through downloading because you're a PlayStation Plus member have to be used while or can only be accessed while you have PlayStation Plus active. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I got. I think I still have Infinite on my PlayStation 3. Infinite? Bioshock Infinite. Ah. I actually want to get the Biostock. Biostock? Bioshock Collection. I see. Alright, okay. Do I want Summer Shorts? Because. I mean, she looks kind of tomboyish as it is. I don't know, let's see. Or do I want it to look like a wrong button? Drifter. I'm going to add that to my download list. What? Neverwinter? Oh, because I said something? Yeah. Whew. I thought about I don't I thought about redownloading it. I really have. Oh wait wait wait. 
That's only to start the application. <laughs> yeah. All right, let me get my weapon set up here going to see. All right, so we got pipe pistol. Wrong. There we go, pipe revolver. Oh, I can level up. Wow. Duh. <laughs> oh. Uh. <sighs> All right, Crash, what do you think? Aqua Girl? Which is, makes me, you know, I can go in the water and never die. Black Widow, which give men a suffer 5% damage in combat and are easier to persuade. Or should I go with something like guns, like Gunslinger or something? Oh, fun. I have to start all over on Rogue Galaxy now, too. Why? Well, apparently when I deleted the game off of my library, I deleted my save file. Didn't it back up to your cloud storage? It should have, but apparently it's... I have no idea. It's okay, I don't fucking care. I have to start over anyway, so... Oh, yeah? Yeah, I was going to start over anyway, so... It's no big deal. Look at this majestic animal right here. Look at him, so majestic. Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? Oh, you're not watching the stream. I'm just saying, look at the... <laughs> you seem like an okay guy. Okay, then. Let's stick together. Hey. Grab that. Get that. <laughs> As you were. Uh, all right, he said he... So you beat 12, huh? That only took you like, what, two weeks? Well, that's because I was 
taking my taking my time ish. Oh no, you did get stuck and you restarted like seven different times. I know, right? <laughs> What can I say? Restarting is fun. Yeah. There is a chest. It's a rifle. Well, oh well. Yay! Yay, I got a mellow banana. <laughs> Just a mellow one, huh? Yep. Yay, more heal potions.
Yay, I got a Sanchez fruit. Oh yeah? Yep. I find it a chest with a thunderstone. Quick, give it to Pete. Pikachu. No, I actually need to use it to learn an ability. I just learned Flash Sword. I learned Barry Allen sword. Yay, I got a max heal. I can't open that one. Level three. Yeah. Me too. Ironically. <laughs> oh, I don't know what to get. You know what? I'm going to get Gunslinger and I'm going to go to the back. I will be right back. I am back. Welcome back. Yeah. just started downloading you know it is the nice thing about cable rather than doing my DSL cuz DSL took forever you know mm-hmm yeah so I've got five minutes left to start sword art online re hollow fragment and then three hours left to fully download it Oh yeah. Whereas for Neverwinter, I've got eight hours left for it to be fully downloaded. <clears throat> hmm. 
All right, I got. Uh, let's see here. Metal. <sighs> it's time for me to kill my lungs. Again? You just came back in. No, I didn't. It must just be me then. I had been in for a little bit. For at least half an hour. That was smart. What? I threw a grenade in this. I totally boosted it. Ooh, 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 ooh. Who do you think would win in a death battle? Meta or Carolina? Uh, Meta? <laughs> Go to YouTube and type in death battle meta versus Carolina screw attack screw attack yeah well, that's right then Our favorite buddies are, uh, are actually, are actually posed that question, and then guess who called, uh, called screw attack to figure out who would win? Rooster Teeth. No, oh, no. It was, yeah, it was Rooster Teeth, but which character in the Rooster Teeth's Halo series? Ooh. Red versus blue. I'm going to go with Caboose. Uh-huh. Caboose is the one who called command to send over Wiz and Boomstick. Wiz and Boomstick make an appearance in red versus blue. Wiz is blue. Boomstick is red. Ah, oh, of course. That oh, figures. And you Just know Sarge? Yeah. Well, there's a little spoiler in there for you. Apparently, Sarge is Boomstick's daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Just based on... You will be able to tell this immediately based on the conversation between Sarge and Boomstick. Oh, yeah? Yeah. He said, Sarge basically says, You're like the son I never had. And then Boomstick says, Oh, you're like the daddy I never knew. My daddy ran off to the, join the military before I was born. And then Sarge just kind of casually, or kind of backs up slowly and then runs away. 
<laughs> because he realizes Dick is his son. Got it. But yeah, it's a very interesting death battle. So is the one again. So is the one between Chuck Norris and Sagata Sanchiro. Nice. Chuck Norris and who? Sagata Sanchiro. Dude, who the hell is that? Apparently, he's the guy who saved Sega. Back when Sega Saturn came out. I've never been back in this room. What room? I'm in the Museum of Freedom. And... There's an area back here that I've never been to. And I've been into the Museum of Fr Freedom like hundreds upon hundreds of times. Some whatnot? <laughs> I think one of my mods added, I think this is actually cut. So you're doing a modded playthrough? Yeah, I don't really care about trophies. I'm not like a certain somebody on our friends list. <laughs> I know, right? How many platinum trophies is he up to now? Dude, I don't know. I haven't even looked at his profile. <laughs> I mean, what's the point? That just shows you how much of a life he has. Or lack thereof, I should Dude, say. I actually think this was a cut content that was restored. <sighs> well, that was different. now uh the game where you have lots of fun killing people hey. oh let's see let's see that could be either dragon quest heroes fallout 4 final fantasy 15 oh wait i don't have final fantasy 15 because no. i lent it to you yeah if you want to take it back, you can. I, I'm going to try, probably going to start working on a World of Final Fantasy first anyways. Right. In all honesty, World of Final Fantasy is, a, is way more hilarious than... Or, it, literally, World of Final Fantasy is pretty much a satirical Final Fantasy game. Yeah. Everything about it is a freaking joke. It's basically Final Fantasy's attempt to make a Pokemon game. Yep. With Final Fantasy monsters. Of course. Oh. 
Oh. Of course, I could re-download Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Why? Why would you download that garbage? I know, right? Played it once with Bob. I did not like it whatsoever. I could download Dragon Fantasy, the Black Tome of Ice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was like five bucks on the PlayStation Store. Oh, was, was that a PSN game? Usually those are pretty cheap. Yeah. Yeah, it's a PSN game. Some of those PSN games are actually pretty good. I think I downloaded I know. Dungeon Defenders PS3, which actually I had a blast with it for the short time I played it. Is that ooh, still ooh, ooh, my PS3? I could re I could re-download Little Big Planet 3. Oh yeah. Or I could re-download Mousecraft. Yeah. I'm not prob. I'm probably not going to re-download Minecraft. <laughs> yeah. I, I, yeah. I have both the PS4 and the PS3 edition. Yeah. I thought about getting that Lego Worlds game. Dude. What? If you do, stream it. I want to see... I know it's a Lego game, but still. Yeah. I thought about it. I don't know, it's been a bit... It's been a minute since I have ventured into the GameStop store. <laughs> of course, I could always re-download Trove. Was that that free game you were trying to get me to play? Yeah. Yeah, it's basically MMORPG Minecraft. Yeah, you know Minecraft does have a multiplayer option. I know, but there's but there isn't really a level system in Minecraft. There is yeah. in Trove. I actually kind of prefer to play games with a level system. Uh, dude, Destiny comes out in two weeks. No, a little bit less than two weeks. No, a little bit more than two weeks. Crap, I don't remember. Are you talking about Destiny 2? Yeah. Destiny 2 comes out on the 6th of September, which is about three, four weeks away. Oh, yeah. Maybe three and a half weeks. Because if we're going a full month from the day, from the day it released, that was three days ago. Yeah. So. So about a month and or about a week or uh, about a three bit and under a half a weeks month. till. About a little yeah. under a month. How about we just yeah. do that? That works. Yeah. Apparently, I have drawn to death as a thing I downloaded I don't never remember downloading it hmm. I'm coming in there and I'm gonna skin every last one of you come on man they ain't going nowhere we got other shit to deal with hey shit. of course I could always Redownload Metal Gear Solid 5 Ground Zeroes, which was a free game a while ago. If it lets you. Well, yeah, no, it should because you're an active PlayStation Met Plus member. I th yeah. think they. Unless. I don't, I don't know. No. You can. If you have a game that's downloaded, you can, all, you can always re download it from your library. But in order to actually play it, you have to have PlayStation Plus in order to uh, play games that you got with, got for free with the PlayStation Plus membership. Ah. Uh, so basically, like Rocket League, which I got for free with PlayStation Plus, I can't play it unless I have PlayStation Plus. 
I didn't realize you got Rocket League for free. Yeah, I got it when it was uh, for free on PlayStation. Nice. Or when it was a PlayStation Plus free game. So. Just kind of like how I got Just Cause. Yeah, I got it too. Yeah, the last past few months they haven't really been that good. Man, I don't know who you are, but just come to Mama. I know. I mean, at least Just Cause is a freaking Square Enix game, so you know yeah. it's pretty good. Usually, just from their logo being there. Usually, Square Enix games are pretty good. As you can see, we're in a bit of a mess here. I mean, take the collaboration between Capcom and Square. For breath of Fi for the breath of fire series, Ugh, baby, the world's changed that was so much. that was a pretty good series. You all right? Listen, until need your help. until um, yeah, Dragon Quarter came out, yeah. out then it all went to shit. Yeah. Looking for an infant boy. That's what killed the franchise right there. Yours or tracking for someone else? Used to be a lot of families in this group. That one game. That one horrible game. Wait, wait, what was the game again? It was Breath of Fire Dragon Quarter. Oh, was it that bad? Yeah. Yeah, it was. The main character looked like he was running in place half the time. You don't know the half of it. Anyway. I mean, they did such a shitty job of bringing it to a 3D screen. Well, we do have one idea. Nope. Well, let's hear it. <coughs> I mean, the early attempts with Breath of Fire, Breath of Fire 2, Breath of Fire 3, and Breath of Fire 4. Now, Breath of Fire 3 and 4 were for the PlayStation. Granted, they were slightly 3D, but they were mostly 2D maps. Hmm. Uh, or I should say, the sprites were 2D, but the map was 3D. Oh, and yeah. the, and the, they had different sides of the sprite for whichever way you were facing. That's some serious protection. Oh, it gets better. Which, those two games Get were pretty suit. good for rip the right off the being on the PlayStation. No which I have Breath of Fire 4 on my PS3. Yeah. Really wish they would have put Breath of Fire 3 on there as It'll well. Work, provided we can react instead of just Breath of Fire 4. It's totally out of juice. Mm. Probably had 3 better than 4 years. in your opinion? It can be powered up again. Yeah. But we're a bit stuck. Three better than four because one, instead of you having to, instead of you having like a total of, I'd say, five dragon transformations in four, you have a total of like, let's see, you have whelp, dragon, warrior, behemoth, pygmy, um, Look, hybrid, stuff. Kaiser, Bypassing security that's already exactly seven right there. Team. That's two more, just between, it. just between Kaiser and hybrid, you have two more dragon transformations right. than you do in Maybe Breath of Fire 4. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. Yeah, I know what you're thinking. And plus, I was able to... I'm, I know where pretty much all the dragon genes are for that game. No thanks. I don't do guns. Which, in Breath of Fire 3, you have to find purple crystals housing the spirit... housing the, basically the spirit of a dragon of a specific gene. In order to acquire that dragon gene. All the way up, except for the infinity gene. That you actually have to kill a dragon in order to get. Well, defeat defeat a dragon in order to get. 
Skill, defeat, it's all the same thing, Grash. Yeah, except when you kill the dragon, the person that turns into the dragon that you have to fight doesn't die. He's still alive. So. And on top of that, in Breath of Fire 3, your dragon forms have separate HP than your character's form. So when the dragon, say you're in a dragon right. form, it usually has more HP than your character does at any given moment. You transform into a dragon, dragon dies, you come back, you get reverted back to your human form. And you're still alive with the amount of HP you had before you transformed into a dragon. Nice. However, Breath of Fire 4, I don't think does that. Because I've transformed into a dragon and then the dragon forms died and then I, and then the main character, Ryu, ended up being dead too. Hmm. So. Visions. Uh-huh. <laughs> I know what you're uh, thinking. This old lady, she's out man. there. <sighs> what to do? But it's the chems. They give old Mama Murphy the size. I really want to play Neverwinter. But I can't right now. I have to wait. Oh. I'm listening. I have to wait like nine hours. <laughs> we'll play um, Elder Scrolls or something. No, I don't. I don't really want to play any online game right now because that'll eat up my bandwidth, my up and download speeds. Play and Fallout. Or did you buy that one off the store? I bought that one off the store and I've already downloaded it. Uh, is Hollow Fragment already done downloading? No, it's not. It's just not showing me the download bar. Well, at least I'm at 1.245 gigs out of 16.962 gigs for Neverwinter. <laughs> and I've got four hours left on Sword Art Re Hollow Fragments uh, full download. Oh, so you don't have to come over here. You don't have to wait till like 4.30 to come over, man. You can always come over whenever. Oh, I know. I know. But I'm just saying, I was planning on, uh... I was planning on coming over after uh, Claire went to bed, so you and I could actually do something other than sit around and watch My Little Pony. Yeah, yeah, that is true. <laughs> I will let you suffer through that because she is your daughter. Yeah, but if it's nice tomorrow, I might do other things with her. Oh, good. It's starting to get night out. Yes, I know, dog meat. You found something. <laughs> Personal log. United States Army Staff Sergeant Michael Daly. This past Saturday, October 23rd, while en route to West Stockbridge, a vertebrate crashed into the roof of this museum. The cause, EMP following nuclear detonation. Several, in fact. Uh. From the intel I've gathered, this was a global event. The co-pilot was killed on impact. The pilot died of his injuries a day later. The day after that, Flaherty and Kanawa were shot by some scared, desperate survivors. I highly doubt you are playing the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. I'm not. I'm actually playing Fallout. It's actually corrected on Twitch. Even on Twitch's website, it shows I'm streaming Fallout. <laughs> Woohoo! Never 
winter has the length of time or the amount of hours of sleep I normally require to function normally. <clears throat> Although I can function normally after six, six between six to eight hours of sleep, I just prefer to get at least eight hours of sleep. Chances are I'm probably going to have to start over on Sword Art Online or E-Hollow Fragment as well. Probably. But it's whatever. It's whatever. I do not care. Look, a death claw. Yeah, you know what the funny thing is? Pretty much every game I have is an RPG game. And? There we go. Oh, freaking death bomb. That pretty much frees up a bunch of space on my home menu. By throwing a bunch of games into a folder. I didn't realize you could do that. Yeah, all you do is go to the options on a game and then add to folder. And then it'll give you an op- and then it'll it, it'll give you add to new folder or add to existing folder. Which if you have no folders, you can add to a new folder. And then you can go to content and you can select what games you want to put in what folder. Nice. Yeah. Alright I know, right? It that makes was... finding all your games that much easier. That was a rather interesting fight with the death claw. Did you use the minigun? Of course, I always use the minigun. <laughs> Gotta love the minigun. Ooh, ooh. I'm going to say a quote from a TV show. Try to guess it. Okay. Gotta love the baby. Uh, it's either dinosaurs or South Park. Dinosaurs. You were right the first time. No. Hey, Ike. Kick the baby. Don't that kick the baby. Is, that one is definitely South Park. Yep. yep. Now this one comes from a movie I don't know if you've seen or not. So what if I'm a puppet? Once upon a time, you were too. Uh, 
Wasn't that Advent Children? You got it. Dude, I have that. Oh, you do? Yes. And oh, we I watched didn't know that. it together. <laughs> Damn it. <sighs> Man, have you like been living under a rock or something? Um, let's see. Uh Not really. I mean, I've been kind of living wherever the wind takes me, so I wouldn't say I was living under a rock. There he I'd is. say more like up in a tree or <sighs> over top of a volcano. <laughs> Dude, I guarantee you, if anyone else other than you or me watches your broadcasts, they will think we are stoners with the conversations we have. Take it easy, mama. Yeah, but you know we're not. I, I know. I <sighs> Running, running, running. That was a pretty amazing display. You guys gonna be okay now? Let me see what yeah. trophies I still need for anyway. Neverwinter. We can at least move some Listen, when we first met, you said you were glad to help. At least the base game. Well, you did, and we owe you our lives. So yeah. It ain't much, but it's the best way I ah. can say thank you. I still need Barrow Scholar, Bump in the Night. Hey, sorry. I'm which, one being in it only that one's so, pretty easy to get. You know, you I just need a. The other minute, minute, I just need to um, who gave their lives for something defeat a giant sense. eyeball, floating eyeball, tentacle He's monster the thingy. <laughs> Alright, Garvey. I'm in. I need to kill 500 devils, a thousand dragons, 50 dragons, 500 drow, I need to complete 25 epic dungeons. Is this for Neverwinter? This is for Neverwinter. Okay. I also need to stand eye to eye with your greatest, with my greatest fears, which I have no idea how to get that one. Need to defeat 500 foul spawn. Get to level 60 with two heroes. Defeat 50 giants. Kill 500 goblins. Kill 500 werewolves, were rats, and the like of that. I need to collect 250 pieces of lore. I need to defeat 500 spiders. And discover all scrying so stones in 14 zones. And the name of that trophy is... Would you look at it? Just look at it. About it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her glory? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on your best friend and on our And that's just to get a platinum trophy in the base game. For legendary adventures, I need to reach level 70 with one character, level 70 with two characters. Defeat Tiamat, defeat all four dragons in the Dragonflight, 
in a single encounter, earn gold victory in Demogorgon. Demogorgon? Earn gold... Is this, in go is, yeah. is, this, is this Elder Scrolls? No, no. This is still Neverwinter. Man, there is a lot of trophies. I mean, I really kind of like... I do like Elder Scrolls Online. I just, you know, it's one of those things that we actually gotta take our time with. I know it's... I know, I'm just... But... But those trophies are not for the base game. Those are for the Legendary Adventures DLC. The base game I'm already halfway done with for Platinum. Yeah. I haven't even started to get any of the DLC con the trophies yet. At least for that one. For this one... For Elder Scrolls, let's see, I need Hidden Trophy, Hidden Trophy, Hidden Trophy, Hidden Trophy, Hero of the Aldemary Dominion, Hero of the Daggerfall Covenant, Hero of the Ebonheart Pact, Aldemary Master Explorer, Daggerfall Master Explorer, Ebonheart Master Explorer, Cold Harbor Master Explorer, Cyrodiil Cave Delver, Level 50 hero. No, wait, wait. Indecent how would, exposure. How would you become a master explorer? That means you discovered everything? <clears throat> okay. Discover and clear all caves and locales throughout the Aldemary Dominion. I'm very glad Same thing for Daggerfall Covenant oh, okay. and Ebonheart Pact. Basically, once you get to an area, you walk through the whole entire area. Then you get to the next area, you go through the whole entire area. Yeah, yeah. Indecent exposure is have stolen clothing from all your armor slots repossessed at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> By a guard. <laughs> <coughs> I already have lycanthropy. I need vampirism. Archmage, which is basically just complete the Mage's Guild series of quests. Fighter's Guild Veteran, complete Fighter's Guild series of quests. General Executioner, destroy all, destroy all of Molog Ball's generals that appear at the Dark Anchors. Destroy every Dark Anchor in Tamriel, which is Anchors Away. Defeat all the public dungeon champions in the Aldemary Dominion. Man, some of those sound which is really, basically... really tough. It's one of those things that we need to actually yeah. get on there and stay on there for like a couple of weeks just to get our levels up. Because we always do this. We start playing it and then we stop. I know, right? Or one of us gets what ahead need... of the other. <laughs> I know, right? And what we need is actually a... A... At least one other person to join us on ESO. That's yeah. e that's that can pretty much be a DD. DD. What would DD be? Damage dealer. Ah. DPS. So we need a DPS, a healer, and a. So we need DPS, healer, and CC. Or tank. Or a tank. Hey, what the fat girl say when she saw the pig? Oink oink. The right Could be some good salvage in there. see about that. The ham. Well, I'll tell you this. Yeah, at least you'll get a trophy for finding all the sky shards. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, that's a pain in enough as it is. You literally have to walk around everywhere to find those. I know.
And dude, some of this stuff... Some of this stuff you have to do in, uh, PvP. Yeah. And I'm not a big PvP fan, so... ESO is one I'll never platinum. Yeah. You should go back and do some of the Destiny stuff. I'm not worried about Platinum Destiny. Let me see... Dude, my Destiny stuff is... For base game, 46%. Taken King, 33%. Rise of Iron, 41%. I just need to earn rank one in the crucible. Yeah, pretty much everything else, everything I have left, other than raider, raiding party, epic raider, flawless raider, and whatnot, and the ghost hunter. Yeah, ghost hunter would be a pain too. Yeah, because you literally have to hunt through every nook and freaking cranny looking for dead ghosts yeah and then for like titan mastery i highly doubt i'll ever play a titan again because uh, yeah they're supposed to be the tank but they're squishy as fuck yeah And then all I need to do is fully upgrade an exotic weapon. So, yeah. Hmm. Let's see here. Let's see, what do I need for... Ah, uh, yes, I need to deal 999,999 damage with a single blow. That's going to be fun to try and do. Of course. Isn't it always? All right. Scrap, 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 scrap. Well, I'll tell you this. The uh, consecutive hit trophies for Revenant Saga are going to be really hard for me to get. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Same with the overkills. Why? Do you have any idea how hard it is to overkill an enemy in Revenant Saga? No idea. I've never even heard of the game before, to be honest with you. Uh, didn't I broadcast it for you? Ah, oh, crap. I don't re I think you did, but I don't remember it off the top of my head. Yeah, that's because... Oh, yeah, that's right. Um, This is before I switched over my stuff to save it to the archive and whatnot. Yeah. You were going to watch my broadcast of it, but never got to see it because it got deleted. Yep. I'm always glad to see the sun come up one more time. Preston. Glad you decided to come with us. But hey, at least Globetrotter will be easy to get. All you have to do is just walk 250,000 steps. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. I used to like living here. Before the war. <sighs> what do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... I lived here over 200 years ago. I, I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. 
like one of those old pre-war ghouls. Oh. You say you were frozen. Whoa. Did anybody else make it out with you? What? Okay then. Just my son. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. I've been looking for him. Damn. I'm sorry. I hope you find him. Okay, so apparently I have uh, three 100% trophies for uh, Warframe updates. Oh, yeah? Warframe update 2 and 3 I have 100% for, and Warframe update 15 I have 100% for. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. They're still hoping there are Minutemen out there. Base game, though. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on I have a lot of crap I need I still need to get. I've got my hands full here. I need to get the trophy for healer, shotgun proficiency, which for that I just need to get, achieve rank 30 with any shotgun weapon. I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. Same thing for rifle proficiency, pistol proficiency, pole weapon pro uh, proficiency, heavy weapon proficiency. Dagger proficiency, brawler proficiency. Yeah. And that's just the base game. For update one, I need to revive a hundred a hundred allies for the field medic trophy. Oh yeah? Yeah. Update four. I need to kill the boss in the urine. Uranus region and get to extraction. Hmm. For update five. I basically have to kill the boss on Sedna. Update six. Complete ten missions without any primary or secondary weapons equipped. And then I also have to deflect 1,000 projectiles with melee weapon. Update 7. Earn battle pay from 5 unique invasions. Okay. Complete 5 missions for a clan consisting of... Or contesting a dark sector? Eh. Probably will never play this anymore. What? Warframe. Because there's friggin' at least 20 updates that you can get trophies for. Yeah, I've always wondered about that. I know, right? Honestly, I would much rather get the rest of the, get the rest of friggin' Neverwinter trophies. Just for the base game. That's all I care about. Getting the base game trophies done. Yeah. After I do that, I will focus on leveling up. Yeah. And working on my freaking um, DLC trophies. For Neverwinter? Well, for yeah. Fourth? Neverwinter. Okay. And also for ESO, except for the PvP ones. Yeah, I should log into that and play for a while. I probably will never do the PvP on ESO. At least until, at least not until I'm like, until I've got a better grasp of the game. Yeah. And I think that's our issue. We start playing it and then we stop because we don't get a grasp on it. Right, right. Yeah. What we need is an experienced player to join us to basically help us learn our roles to the utmost extent of our abilities. I mean, yeah, I've we... pretty much played you. I've, we can pretty much do that on our own. I mean... I was going to say, you're a pretty good healer. I mean, I can do a DPS character. I know, right? Character. I have no issues doing that. I'd rather go in and whack stuff. I know, right? <clears throat> Me, I'm more of the... 
I'm more of the type that'll just kind of hang back, keep people alive. <coughs> Unless you're not paying and attention. Basically, <laughs> right, right. Right, it's like... If I, if I get a sudden case of, ooh, shiny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you hear me randomly say, ooh, shiny. Then don't attack anything. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, literally, in DC Universe, one of the... Uh, one of the feats is literally find ten collectible items, and the name of the feat is Ooh Shiny. Yeah. Yeah, literally. And get this. <clears throat> this is all you have to do in order to get the Platinum Trophy. Acquire all hero and villain trophies in the classic game. And for that... You pretty much have to achieve level 10 and gain the tank roll, achieve level 10 and gain the controller roll, achieve level 30 as a hero mentored by Batman, achieve level 30 as a hero mentored by Wonder Woman, achieve level 30 as a hero mentored by Superman, achieve level 30 as an agile movement character, or at, with an agile movement mode, achieve level 30 with an aerial movement mode, Achieve level 30 with a swift movement mode. Achieve level 10 and gain the healer roll. Got it. Achieve level 30 as a villain mentored by Cer Circe. Achieve level 30 as a villain mentored by Lex Luthor. Achieve level 30 as a villain mentored by the Joker. And then Platinum Pace. And literally all you need to do is just complete one race with a Platinum Medal. It doesn't even have to be a hard race. It can literally be the race right outside of the safe house. And what's funny is they're pretty much all gold and silver trophies to begin with. You could say that. There are no bronze trophy or copper trophies in the base game of DC. Hmm. There it is. Just say the word. No, not now. All right, then. Uh, oh, I gotta go read that special book before I forget. And I will forget. And I did forget because I just reminded myself. Damn it. There we go. That's it. Wow. That safe had a lot of stuff in it. Really? Yeah. It had ammo and a rocket launcher. Seriously? A rocket launcher? No, it, it did have a pistol and a lot of ammo. Oh yeah, I forgot I played South Park The Stick of Truth on my PS3 and beat it. Was Mr. Hanky in it? Yeah, actually he was. Mr. Hanky, the Christmas poo. <laughs> yeah. Good this, the very first trophy you get, new kid on the block. Yeah. Please note, this is South Park, the stick of truth. You have you have joined the KKK. Why? Why? Why would they? Oh my gosh! You know what? I, I'm not even surprised. It Kingdom is. of Koopa Keep. 
Blame Eric Cartman. Yep. Yep. Yeah, literally, that trophy is for you just joining the kingdom of Koopa Key. Which is pretty much Eric's backyard. Of course it is. Okay, four. Ah, uh, I should have put another one in agility. Oh, well. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. What? Made this for you. You flung a turd of your own creation at an enemy. Alright then. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. I need to do that. I need to get that trophy. Are we cool? Found Jesus while playing as a Jew. <laughs> Is this the South Park game still? Yeah. Okay, so... <clears throat> For the Hoarder, complete the game without selling any items. Oh, that's hilarious. I completely forgot I got that trophy. <laughs> I'd be glad to help. Just tell me what you need. Well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground for too long. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof. You shat your pants during a boss battle. Still looks solid enough <laughs> to do the trick. There's a workbench over there yeah, you can It's called it. irritable bowels. Oh, and just so you know, your character's name throughout the entire game is called is douchebag. Really? Yeah. Doesn't matter what you name your character, it's always going to be douchebag. So, one of the trophies is acceptance. You've accepted your fate and chose the name Douchebag yourself.
<sighs> so you want to know what the tr what all the trophies are for uh, Final Fantasy X or for the Final Fantasy X X Two remaster for Final Fantasy? Um, let me find it. Let me find it. Where are you, Final Fantasy X? There we go. Oh dang, there's two hidden trophies. Make that three hidden trophies. Oy. What? Some of these, some of the trophies on for Final Fantasy X seem uh, seem like they're going to be um, they, like um, defeat Penance and Nemesis. Uh, which one was that one? Yeah, I'm only missing two trophies for uh, for Jetpack Joyride. Oh yeah. Yeah, for the PS3, that's Romeo Alpha Data Delta. Romeo Alpha Delta. And all the things. And then I have that. Then I have that one done. But it's not like it matters. How so? No platinum trophy for Jetpack Joyride. Ah. Dude, if you go through my entire trophy list, 
you will see all the freaking games that I have played on both my PS3 and my PS4. Oh, yeah? Yeah, let's see. I've got one. Well, you did the same thing I did, didn't you? You kept your PS3. Well, no, it died, but you still got another one. Right? My original PS3 died. Yeah. Then I got another one, and yes, I still have that one. Man, I love this mod. I have 142 games on my trophies list. Yeah, I don't think I have that many. Yeah, I was literally just counting the entire list. And some of them, like DCUO trophies, are for both PS3 and PS4. So some of the games are on there twice. Alright, so how many games were on there twice? Um, let's see, just, as far as I know, just DCUO and, um, well, Rainbow Moon is on there once, but that's, but that's because it's a cross-platform. So how is that one a cross-platform, but DCO isn't? I have no idea. Mm. All right. I need furniture. Just two. So you really have 140 games on there. Yeah. But I also have Super Mother Load for both PS3 and PS4, so. Ah. So if you count the games that I have on PS4 as opposed to PS3, it, you could technically count them as two separate games. Dude, 
Dude, I can't believe it's already 2.15. I know, right? Isn't it lovely? No, actually, I should be going to bed here soon, too. It's, no, it's not because I don't, it's not because I can. It's because Ferris is coming home early at 11. It means I've got the little girl to deal with. Right. As I freeze up my game. I wanted to thank you for helping us out in Concord. If only we'd run into you sooner. That all work uh, out, right? No. Yeah, so tomorrow I'll be able to play Neverwinter. My son, he's Oh well, that's well, kind of bad. He's gone. Well, I mean, when I wake up I'll be able to play Neverwinter. That's awful. No parents should have to lose their child. No. No, they shouldn't. I just keep thinking. Maybe I could have done more. Whew. Anyway. Holy cow. Thanks again. Some of that stuff goes right through you, you know? I know, right? It's cancer time one last time, and then I'm going to bed. You know, I think you said that a while ago, and you were still up. <laughs> if I remember correctly. No, I said it. What I said a while ago was, I really should sleep. Yeah, and then I ache John saying that uh, sleep is for the week. Yeah. Especially since I have to open after Friday. You wait, you have to do, you have to open on Friday? No, I have to open on Saturday and Sunday. Oh, yeah? Yeah, so I'm tr what I've been trying to do is maintain a relatively normal-ish sleep schedule by not staying up till God knows when and then going to bed, sleeping half the day away. Oh, yeah? How's that working out for you? I got a new hard drive. <laughs> So it's I should tell out. you how it's working out for me. It's not working out quite well, is it? No, not since I can house more games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I'm a game freak. I don't care. Dude, I'm not. I'm not giving you a hard time. Trust me. I know. Me. I wish I had money where I could just blow on games. Every time I went into game, I could just go and buy a game. Oh, I know. Just wait for the free games. Well, that's why. Trust me, I've been waiting to get Just Cause 3 for a while, and when I saw it was free, I jumped on that puppy. <laughs> I was like, yep. You jumped on it. You were just like, ooh, it's free? Download yeah, pretty much. <laughs> You're just ooh, it's free. Download. No hesitation whatsoever. You just went straight for it and downloaded it. Yep. Yeah, and I kind of flubbed up a little <laughs> when I played it. <laughs> what do you mean? I, um, wingsuited to the bridge, and then I 
tried to turn around and land on the bridge, I ended up going under the bridge. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah, now I'm trying to get my work my way back up to the bridge. Yeah, I haven't played it yet. I thought about playing it tonight. I was like, eh, I haven't played Fallout in a while either. Right. Just so you know, it is fun. Oh, I know. I know, I'm actually... And, and where I'm I... at, I can't figure out how to make my grapple hook. Grapple me places. Evacuation complete. I couldn't hold it anymore. <laughs> Dude, I drank a half gallon and most of a half gallon. It's to a point where you can't hold it anymore. Oh, I know. I know. I know. I'm just saying. <sighs> Evacuation complete. Yeah. <laughs> Obviously, you know what movie that's from. Yep. I haven't seen that movie in a while, either. Neither uh, have now, I. Now, what the hell is this, dog meat? <laughs> what happened? Uh, you need... <laughs> Dog meat's basically stuck He's in like... the wall. What the hell? How? Dude. How is he stuck in a wall? It's Bethesda. That's all I'm going to have to say about that. Yeah, yeah, true, true. I mean, yeah, their Fallout games are pretty glitchy, but... They're fun as fuck. Hey. Head over there. Wouldn't you agree? Oh yeah. Well I got him unglitched. He was just he was stuck in between the somehow got stuck in between the weapons workbench and the armor workbench in the uh and the house, so Ah. Okay, I am going to go pass out now. All right, man. We'll give you a I will later. see you later. Yeah. Well, I won't give you a holler later. I'll probably see you later. I mean... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm planning on hanging out with my mom for a while, so... That's fine. You know where I'll be. I know. I know. That, and I'm also going to be looking at a TV that oh, she yeah. has at her house. See if it at least has an HDMI port. You're still not playing on an HDMI, are you? Huh? You're still not playing on an HDMI TV? Okay. Oh no, I am. I am. Uh, okay. I have been for the past, like, two years. Oh. I just don't know if the TV that my grandma used to have is HDMI compatible or not. Is it a flat screen or is it the tube? It's a flat screen. I'm pretty sure that when flat screens first came out, ish, around the fir around when the first few series of flat screens came out, they started to put HDMI cables in 
half of that. So I don't know if the one that my grandma had was HDMI compatible or not. Ah. So that's what I'm going to look at when I go to my mom's house later today. Ah. Because if it's not HDMI compatible, I can't take it with me because one, I would need an HDMI port in order to play any of my games because I don't have any of the regular video cables. I only have HDMI video cables. Yeah. And the system I tend to play more often than not is my PS4, which only comes with HDMI. No, there's actually, you can, oh, hold on. I'm saying when you buy it, it comes with an HDMI cable. Oh, yeah, and I think it does only have an HDMI port, now that I think about it. Yeah, PS3, on the other hand, has both HDMI port and video cable port. Yeah. But... Starting from the PS4, they no longer have the video cable because a lot of TVs nowadays come standard with HDMI ports. Oh, yeah. And pretty soon we're going to have 4K TVs as well, if we, already, we don't already have some. We already have, I don't have a 4K TV, but they do already make 4K TVs. Right, right. My parents have a 4K TV. Oh, fun. Yeah, every time we're watching a cartoon or something over there, it's like, I always come, it's like, it looks different. I know, right? I mean, when I, came, when I came in and saw, or when you brought me over to your dad's house, or your parents' house, that oh, no, one time, you, and I saw, and I saw have, Clara watching have, that TV. You have I'm been like, to their house. My dad has a plasma. That was, that was what was in there? No, he now has a 4K TV. Ah. I haven't been there recently, I should say. Yes. Yeah, they got this for free. He went to a place that was an RV place because they thought about buying a camper, and he freaking won a freaking TV there. I was like, are you serious? The fuck, man. The fuck. I know. Your dad is lucky as shit. There are... I know. <laughs> Wish my dad had some of your dad's luck. Yeah. Well. <laughs> hey, Sturgis. You get what I mean, right? Having a place to sleep yep. will improve everyone's spirits. What we need now is a reliable source of clean water. My dad was a uh, sure bit of a like a well. They wouldn't have to keep drinking the river water. Compulsive That's gambler. Good for you. <laughs> and heavy drinker. Yep. I know. He had a few uh drinking and driving tickets that he got. Trust Seems me, I be growing well. That my mom didn't even know about because he would tell me not to tell her. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So I figure, might as well spill the beans after he's dead. What's he yeah. gonna do? Kill me? <laughs> and what was your mom's reaction? Oh, uh, I kind of figured. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Try as he might, he can't hide anything from the woman. Yeah, no, you can't hide anything from a woman. Exactly. No matter how hard you try, they will find it. And they will question you about it. Yep. Just my mom learned that if she questions him about something, he's going to fabricate a tale. As to what led him to do something like that. Yeah. So she's just like, meh, whatever. 
I mean, they were married for over, for like 42 years or something like that. Yeah, I keep forgetting that your parents are significantly older than mine. Yeah. Yeah, because your mom's what? But in her, I, in her 60s now, almost? Uh, she she's can't... halfway through her 60s. Okay, so she's almost in her 70s. She's, I think she turned 65 this year. Wow. Yeah, I turned 29 this year. Yeah. Yeah, your birthday's next. So year. that should took. Yeah. I know. I should be getting a uh, new insurance card here in the mail soon because I have uh, State Farm. Okay, I, I, I don't get the. Um... State Farm usually sends out the insurance cards a month early. Oh, I thought it was because you were turning 30 and they were sending you a special insurance card. <laughs> No, 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 no. No, I turned 29 this year, not 30. Hey, you know what? I'm just going to make you older while I'm at it. <laughs> I mean, why not? Everyone else has. Dude, my coworkers seriously, seriously were like, you're 35, right? I'm like, no, I'm 28. <laughs> what, is, what is wrong with you? Why does everyone think I'm 35? <laughs> and of course, you know, it's because I've got gray hair. Right. But it's probably within your genetics to start getting gray hair at an early age when you're under a lot of stress. Yeah, actually, I think it comes from my mom, because my mom had gray hair when she was young, too. I don't know. Yeah. But in all honesty, me personally, I never really noticed. Yeah, you did. <laughs> you, you knew exactly who caused the gray hair. No, I mean, I mean honestly, when I saw you the for the first time in a while, I didn't even notice you had any gray hair. Yeah. But then again, I'm so used to seeing you with dark hair that I probably just overlooked the lighter colored hair. Probably. <laughs> that, and I also, I also know that you were born the same year I was, so you're the same age as me, just a few months apart. Yeah. And eight days. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so it's not... It's not like I would question your age. It's like... I know. Now, picture this. You and me standing side by side. Someone says, he's 35, he's 30. I'll be like, no, no, no. We're both the same age. We were born in, We were both born in 88. He just... It's just in his genetics to have that color hair early. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. That's one of the reasons why we get along so well. Oh yeah. One, we were born in the same year. Two, we both are pretty avid gamers me more so than you but then again you also have a wife and a kid that you have to provide for right yep me I don't have a wife I don't have a kid I don't even have a girlfriend I don't even have a cat at the moment you have a girlfriend no I don't yeah you do it's attached to you Oh, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, I'm giving you a hard time, Crash. Uh, I know. 
Don't worry, man. There's one out there for you. I know. I know. Just gotta stay away from the crazy ones. That's the challenge. I know, right? It's hard to tell which ones are crazy and which ones aren't. Yeah. If you ask a girl, they say there's a way, but I, I, I you know, I'm sorry. I, I, I just, I don't, I don't, yeah, no, yeah. Yeah, there isn't really any way to tell from a guy's standpoint. Yeah. Women, on the other hand, notice subtle differences. Guys, they just look at their chest. Or their ass. Or their rear end. Exactly. For most guys, it's how big of a rack do they have and how big of an ass do they have. That's all they, that's all most guys care about. Sadly, yes. Sadly, I have to agree with this statement. I know, right? <sighs> oh, yeah. I was going to go to bed. <laughs> well, you know. <laughs> Seems we, to be growing well. We had to have a discussion, so... <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Isn't that usually how it always goes? Yep. I say I'm gonna go to bed, then I'm up for like another half hour to... Or 15 to half hour. Yep. Okay, this is the funny part. I still, I... Have, I still have light going on, and I took out the lights all around this house I was clearing out. Really? Yeah. You know, it's just a glitch. Don't don't you just love video game mechanics? You can shoot out all the lights, but you still get the light. Well, it's just the way it's also the way to design the level. I mean Right. You know. But you would think shooting out the light would cause no light. Yeah, but you, there's so they've got like two light sources, so they've probably got one that's permanently there, and then one that, you know, turns off when you do a certain action that's controlled by a script. I mean... Yeah, that's, probably. That's what I had to do with my real tournament. Yeah, like that room that you instantly die in? Yeah. Yeah, you remember <laughs> that one. Hey, uh -huh. a teleporter! Boom! What the... <laughs> Dude, look, a teleporter. Hey, Instant uh, bodily explosion. I just died? Why did I just die? Oh, you, you went through the trap teleporter? <laughs> I think I said that, too. Yeah, you did. And then I, went, and then I proceeded to go through it again. <laughs> <laughs> At least two or three more times. Oh, chasing after you. I'm like, oh, teleporter. <laughs> because I completely forgot that you said that it was a trap teleporter. <laughs> yeah. And then I'm just like, oh, hey, I'm dead. But anyway, yeah. now I am going to bed. You sure you don't want to stay up and talk for another half hour or so? <sighs> <laughs> Dude, I'm giving you a shit. I know.
Sturgis. Where's it Sturgis? Just because I'm curious. <sighs> okay. Yeah, I'm going to bed. It'd be a good idea. I mean, you can usually tell when I'm when I'm about ready to pass out. Yeah, man, go get some sleep. I mean, don't worry. <laughs> the world I mean, will still be here tomorrow. Hey, Sturgis. I know, I know it will. I mean, it's not like we live in Japan or a fictional universe where the world gets destroyed every other day. Yeah. If we're gonna settle here, we'll need to get some crops established. I mean, just look at the freaking comic books, movies, and whatnot, where the world is always in some what form of peril. Well, it doesn't much matter. Potatoes, mute fruit, and corn, a group of people have to work. stand up or rise up against the peril and defeat it and whatnot. It's freaking stupid. But at the same time, they make the greatest movies. Wait, who does? <laughs> I just love how what I said just went right over your head. Dude, I was you were talking about a movie or something. <laughs> My ADD kicked in. It's like, oh. <laughs> what I was saying, yeah. What I was saying is, yeah. It's not like we live in a world where, or live in a fictional universe where. The world is destroyed every other day. I mean, just look at comic books, movies, and whatnot, where the world is always in some kind of peril, and then some group, a group of people have to rise up and defeat the peril. And then I said it's stupid as shit, but they make the greatest movies. Yeah. I don't know what it is, but... Every time there's a hero against evil, or every time there's good against evil, it's always a good, going to be a good movie. Even when it's not a good movie, it's still a good movie. Even if the critics think it's a stupid movie, it'll still be a good movie. Because it's good versus evil. And that always seems to be a theme in movies, too. Anyway, I'm going to bed. <laughs> Alright, man. <laughs> I'll be up. Night. Night. Actually, I'm getting ready to probably stop. Oh, wow. Well. You know, and I think this is probably a good stop place to stop streaming, too. Now, how do I...